Welcome back to 12 News at 5. 116 years ago this week, a powerful tornado devastated the town of Purvis. According to NOAA, the April 1908 tornado is the eighth deadliest tornado in U.S. history, claiming 143 lives between the mid Louisiana and Purvis, Mississippi. Well, after decades of searching, a group has now found the mass grave where some of the victims of that tornado were buried. 12 News' Brandon Rain spoke with the Lamar County Historical Society about what it means to discover a part of the county's history. After more than a hundred years, a piece of Lamar County history has been discovered at Coal Town Cemetery. On April 24, 1908, an EF4 tornado destroyed much of Purvis. It's believed at least 75 people in Purvis were killed in that tornado. But for decades, the exact location of many victims' burial sites were unknown. There's some mass graves out here. So, but knowing exactly where, we didn't know. The Lamar County Historical Society relaunched the search in 2020 after a resident suggested she had an idea of where the grave site may be. One of our members had talked to uh, Ernestine Thompson, and she says, well, they buried down past where my family's are are buried. My grandmother told us this and they said one thing we can't bury any more members past graves on this road because we'll be getting into where the uh, Paris tornado uh, victims were buried. The Historical Society teamed up with the West Lamar Water Association. With the use of a ground penetrating radar, they were quickly able to locate three unmarked graves covering an area of about 45 feet. It sends a signal down into the ground and it, it was, when the signal comes back, it tells you the, the, the makeup of the under the ground. And so when you run across something that's of a dis different texture or density, then it would send a different signal. Headstone and markers were placed on the graves in February of 2024. The Historical Society says being able to mark the grave site is a way to memorialize those who died and the town's history. Well, they had a, a really a lot really planned in purpose that day because it was graduation day. They had plays that night and that just didn't happen. So I guess it reminds us of mortality and, and how precious life is. But it also reminds us that this, subject, this area is subject to some really severe tornadoes. The Historical Society hopes to eventually identify some of the victims. Reporting in Purvis, Brandon Rains, 12 News.